Hi everyone, today I'm on 14th Avenue in Cabal and you might be thinking, well, what's special about that street? Well, they've installed solar powered street lights. Let me show you one that's up behind me. So can you see up there? That's actually a solar powered street light and it actually has a built in lithium ion battery. So you can see the solar panel at the back there. Sorry, the lighting isn't great, but if you look here, this is the solar panel and then this is the street light. I will include some pictures so you can get a better look at it. But the nice thing about this is that even if there's a power outage, it's still gonna work. Now I looked online for the specs of this and it has a 190 watt hour battery inside, which means even on cloudy days, it's still gonna have enough juice saved to come on so it's not only power efficient because it's led but it's also solar powered which means you can literally install it anywhere you don't have to do any kind of new installation of wiring or anything like that so that's really really useful and if you need to move them around different parts of the city or different streets you literally just have to unbolt it from the pole and then put it onto a new pole let's keep walking and look at some of the others so as we walk along you can see there's another one here there's another one over there. They're all along the road. Maybe we can get a better look at the solar panel on this one. There you go. Let me zoom in so you can get a better look. So based on what I've read, it has a 20 watt solar panel. So all through the day, it's collecting energy and it's storing it in the battery. It's lithium ion. So it's probably gonna have a much longer lifetime compared to lead acid. So that means minimal maintenance. And because it's LED, they last pretty much forever. So the nice thing is that you can basically install it and forget it for a long time. You really don't have to do much with it. And like I said, if there is a brownout, it's still gonna come on. So not only is that a convenience thing, but it's also a safety thing because it's making sure there's always light on the street, either for cars or for people walking around. Now, another place where you're gonna see solar powered street lights in Quezon City is on footbridges, especially the newly made ones. You can see up there that has a solar panel on top. It's LED also, and the box holds the battery. So let me show you a closer look. Now, again, I apologize because the background is so bright, you can't see very easily, but believe me, these are LED based and there's a battery in there and a solar panel on top. So again, even if the grid goes down, these are still gonna light up. And because this is a new footbridge, they didn't have to worry about, well, how are we gonna run electricity to it? Especially because we don't want wires going everywhere. Having it solar powered with a battery just makes things so easy. Now you might be wondering, well, what's the point of this video? Basically, I'm just trying to show you the new technology that's starting to roll out, and especially here in Keton City. Sorry if you can hear the traffic in the background, it's very noisy here. Um, but I just want to show you the kind of changes, the technology, the advancements that are going on that you might not even notice um, because, you know, it's, it's really happening. So anyway, just a short video. But if you did enjoy it, please give a thumbs up and subscribe. And it's starting to rain, so I have to go. But thanks for watching.